Okay, so let's look at the on-site optimization tab. Uh, all the SEO tools on this tab are designed to help you improve your website for users, first and foremost, and also for search engines. Now, if you look at here, there's three things you must do first. Check your page structure, look at your unindexed pages, and your page URLs. So, if you look down the right-hand side, you'll see that I've got some tasks here, one of which is fixed page structure issues. Clicking on that will open up a list of all the pages on my site and the title, H1 headers, page description, page keywords, and an overall structure score. If you've got a structure score of zero, it means you've got some work to do. Clicking on view details pulls up the page and you can see that, okay, I've got a title, although it looks like it's a bit short, but I'm missing H1 tags, keywords, and the description from the page, which isn't very good. Also look down here, my title on this page is too long. Uh, if I look down here, it doesn't look like I've got page descriptions anywhere. I have got some H1 headers in there, but clearly it's highlighting all the issues that I need to address to improve my on-site optimization. So that's a really useful report, and of course you can download that to Excel, uh, fill in the details, and uh, give it to your website developer to upload it. One of the other great tools here is Review on Index Pages. What we do is we crawl your website and we check whether those pages are indexed in Google, Yahoo and Bing. If they're not, and they're an important page, you can use this suite of uh, reports to help you uh, try and identify which pages you need to improve internal or external link structure to. So for example, uh, I've got a page here which um, is not in Yahoo, but it is in our site crawl, it is in Google and it is in Bing. I've got a page here that is not in Google, but it is in our site crawl, it's not in Yahoo, uh, sorry, it is in Yahoo, it is in Bing. So um, I might want to fix that page by um, adding more content to it, changing the metadata, or I might want to build links to it by linking to it from the home page, another key page, or building some external links to it. Or if it's not important, I simply ignore it. So this is a really useful page and a useful report to go through periodically to try and ensure all your important pages are linked. Now, there's a couple of other things on here uh, that we do. We track your index pages and we tell you how many inbound and outbound link domains you've got linking to your site. To make sure, obviously, you want more inbound links than outbound links. And we also list the strongest pages. So this is matching keywords that you're getting traffic for from Google Analytics through to the actual pages on your website. Now, you can obviously download this table and then look at different pages in your site. For example, this page is called Website Redesign and Redevelopment Process, and I can see that I'm attracting the right kind of keyword traffic, website redesign methodology, website redesign process, website redesign process, what to ask clients, etc., etc. So it's useful to help sort of build themes or topics, if centers, if you like, within the content on your site. There are a whole host of other tasks that come up, but they're completely customized to the website. So, for example, if I select a different website from the list, I will get a different set of tools and tasks. As you can see here, I've got a different set of strongest pages. Um, I've got a different set of uh, traffic data relating to index pages, and I've also got a different number of inbound and outbound link domains. And of course, if I click on the tasks, I will get the page structure issues which apply to this website. So um, that's um, the on-site optimization tab. It's a really useful tab, and uh, once you've gone through the issues the first time for your website, it automatically checks everything every week and identifies any other issues it finds for you. A uh, really useful feature and saves so much time and effort doing it yourself. So I hope you like it.